Hi folks. Hope you're okay. And we're just going to look at uh, a few thoughts from Thomas the Kempis. And uh, I hope that it's a blessing to you. Lord my God, I wish to praise thee, for I know that to praise thee was the end of which I was created. Open thou my lips to praise thee, that I may worthily magnify thy name. Lift up my heart to thee, keep me from being weary. Shed forth upon thy grace, kindle in me the heart, in my heart the fire of thy love, that so I may be able to render to thee the, the thanks that are they due. Thy Jew, take thou away the iniquity of thy servant. Wash me from all uncleanness, whether of the flesh or of the spirit, that so I may be made worthy to open my lips to glorify thy name. But all oh, who can worthily extol the depth of thy infinite majesty, all the powers of heaven, all the angelic hosts, can never praise thee worthily. How then can frail man attain Thereafter, who is a thing of corruption and worm, no creature, no thought, no tongue, no language can ever duly praise thee. What then shall I cease from praising thee, because I cannot praise thee worthily? Shall I be silent and close my lips, because I know them to be unclean and myself to be a thing of naught? Far from me be such an ingratitude as that I should cease to praise thee, whom every creature is bound to praise, and above them all men whom thou hast endowed with reason, on whom beyond all others thou hast bestowed so many gifts. O Father of mercies, and God of infinite goodness, I know in truth I confess from the bottom of my heart that, that in thy sight I am a sinner of utter vileness, one who with downcast eyes, with groans and tears, should rather plead for mercy than think of taking upon his polluted lips thy sweet name, and dare to praise it. And yet, Trusting in thy loving kindness, in thy unfathomable goodness, I long to praise thee, beseeching from the depth of my heart the bowels of thy mercies, that thou would not despise me nor hold me back from praising thy glorious name, in pure worm and foul carcass though I be, but while kindle and inflame my innermost soul to praise thee with devout and beautiful lips. Thine all praise, O my God, thou thyself art not canst thou be worthily praised by any other than thyself. For of all things thou art the maker and ruler, and for thee do all things come, whose excellence and whose work declare the glory of thy name. Ever therefore should thou praised, should thou be blessed by every creature, but when the mind contemplates the majesty and longs to join thee in praising thee in thyself for thy supreme goodness, words come not. May then, O oh my God, thy own incomprehensible essence, thy own unspeakable almightiness, thy own unsearchable wisdom. Hello? Hiya, Frank, you okay? 